Hey Alex, this is Gary with Quest Integration. Uh, I just wanted to show you some stuff with DraftSite here really quick, the 3D. So this will be available in DraftSite Premium. Uh, just make sure that you have the solid modeling tab turned on. And uh, we can just start by sketching like any profile that we want. There's a couple of different ways that you can get into kind of the 3D modeling. There's like some standard shapes and stuff you can create, but uh, you just generally sketch out a profile and I'm not going to be like very careful here or anything. You can directly enter numbers uh, through command line, however you want, want to do that. And then what we could do is we could go use the toolbars, or again, if you like the, tool, the command line, you can just type it in. So what I need here is push pull, and then I can select the area that I want to pull, and then I can select the or just type in the distance I want to kind of extrude this out. All right, and then I have a solid. And it's kind of hard to see until I change the view styles that I have here. So if I switch to shaded, I'll be able to see the solid. And if I switch to like an isometric, there we go. I can see my solid model. Um, I can also create a name view so that I could bring this over into a drawing. So if I want to create a new uh, view for a drawing here, I just give it a name and hit OK. Then I just go over to my sheet and I could change this view out or I could just delete it and insert a new view. So to insert a new view, you just go up uh, to the view tiles and you can draw, you know, just part of the page if you want or the full page. And then you can select that view and hit your name views. And then for the model, I'm just going to select the ISO view that I made and click on the view. And there we can see our 3D model.